Imagine this. You've just bought your dream home. At the closing, instead of handing you the keys, the realtor smiles and says, Welcome. You won't need traditional keys anymore. Just use your Amazon account to unlock the door. Wait, what? Why does Amazon have access to my new home? What are they seeing or learning about me when I'm inside? Feels like an intrusion of privacy, doesn't it? Now think about the digital world. Every time you click sign in with Google or log in with Facebook, you're essentially handing over the keys to your personal information. But what does that really mean for your privacy and security? Stick around because today we're uncovering the hidden risks behind those convenient login buttons and what you can do to protect yourself. Let's face it, life is busy. And convenience is everything, it seems. You're signing up for a new app or a service, and there it is, the tempting sign in with Google or continue with Facebook button. One click, no fuss. But this convenience is a double-edged sword. By choosing the easy route, you're opening a door, much like giving Amazon access to your whole home, to share more than you might realize. So how does this actually work? When you use your Google or Facebook account to log in, you're authorizing that third-party site to access specific information from your profile. This could include your name, email address, profile picture, and sometimes even your friend's list or contacts, depending on the permissions you grant. Permissions that are often buried in the fine print. Now here's where it gets concerning. By granting access, you're not just sharing data. You're giving these sites permission to store it, use it, and potentially share or sell it. According to a 2022 study, over 70% of third-party apps share user data with advertisers. Do you know where your information is going? These third-party sites can combine your social media data with information from other sources to build a detailed profile about you. This means more targeted ads, manipulated content feeds, and even price discrimination on products and services. For example, two people might see different prices for the same flight based on their data profiles. Let's talk security. If your Google or Facebook account gets hacked, it's not just those accounts at risk. It's every connected app and service. In 2021 alone, Facebook reported over 50,000 compromised accounts per day. Imagine an attacker gaining access to your email, personal files, even financial information, all because of one breached account. Consider this. You decide to take a digital detox and delete your Facebook account, or perhaps it gets suspended unexpectedly. Suddenly, you're locked out of every other service where you used Facebook to log in, from your favorite shopping sites to essential productivity tools. Recovering access can be a frustrating and time-consuming process. Managing who has access to what becomes a huge task. Some apps might have access to your basic profile, others to your contacts, and keeping track is overwhelming. Revoking permissions isn't always straightforward, leaving your data exposed longer than you might intend. So what's the alternative? Create separate accounts using your email address for every service you log into. Yes, it takes a few extra minutes, but it puts you in control of your data and security settings. Use a reliable password manager to keep track of unique, strong passwords for each account. And two-factor authentication adds an extra layer of security, making it significantly harder for unauthorized access. Now, I know that this may sound confusing, but to make this easier, I'm offering a free training on how to use the free ProtonPass password manager on my website at awcrap.tech, A-W-C-R-A-P.tech. ProtonPass is a powerful free tool that simplifies managing your passwords while enhancing your online security. 
No more relying on big tech companies to safeguard your keys. Details are in the description below this video. It's time to take control of your digital life. Remember our new home analogy? Just as you wouldn't give Amazon the keys to your front door, think twice before handing over access to your personal data online. Your information is valuable. Protect it. If you found this helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it with others you care for. Let's empower everyone to make safer choices online. Stay safe and stay informed.